And what you're seeing here, this waiting for a correction screen is about the most common troubleshooting phone call that I do get. To fix this, we want to go setup, GPS base station. We want to verify our settings. So if you're launching on a fixed pull, select base, make sure our heights are okay, hit next. When we get to our radio screen, that's where we want to make our changes. So let's hit configure, select the base station. It usually takes a second, but eventually this screen will pop up. It'll show our current channel and our current protocol. Um, we recommend taking a photo of this screen just so when we do connect to the rover, we can make everything match. So for this, it's saying we're on channel 464.500 and we're doing PDLTX. That just means that it's transmitting, which we want a base to do. We can hit set. Then from here, we'll continue to launch our base normally. So next, finish. Let's select that base station again. Should say base started okay. We're gonna survey and connect to our rover. We're still getting the way to correction. So now we need to check our radios on the rover itself. So setup, radios, configure, and it'll, that same familiar screen will pop up. So it shows right here that we're actually on a different channel. So we need to get to that 464 500. 464 500. The only other difference should be our protocol here. Ours says PDL RX, which is PDL receiving, and that's what we want our rover doing. So we'll make sure our channel's good, everything else is good. Hit set. Let's hit OK. And now that we've verified both radio channels on the base and rover, everything should be green and you can get to work. Thanks for watching. My name's Zach Armbrecht. I'm a great control specialist for Pape Machinery, Seattle region. Been with the company for about seven years. Please remember to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.